I'm ahead too. From Preston, in Lancashire, Colossus. Fought in the Sick Wars, lost its first battle though. Right, this is Team Colossus. Your robot is Colossus. What does it do? Uh, well, it has two 100 mil bore rams in it. It has um, a diamond edge disc running off a 750 motor. Disc at the back, flipper at the front. Yeah. Is that a lethal combination? We hope so. Two wheel chain driven with 11 inch go kart wheels, the body panels of titanium dural with a Kevlar steel knitted wool inner, has the pneumatic flipper and the diamond cutting disc, but is not yet tested in battle. From Brighton in East Sussex and number four seed, Bigger Brother. Runners up in the fifth wars and three time semi finalists. Ian! Yes! We have seen a lot of seeds go out this year. Have you modified your robot? Well, no, it's our turn to go out. See, that's it. That's. <laughs> We're not going to break the trend here. You're not. You're going to go out. Straight away, round one. Round one. Well, we'll try not to, but you know the way it goes. Flipping tostastic, mate, so they say. The Cobalt Titanium rear armour, bulletproof. The Spike Ram Flipper, awesome. Never beaten in the first round of any heat. From Lansing in West Sussex, URO. Newcomers, Team MIBO. Oh, Jane, find out what that means for me. Here you are, men in black. Overalls. Liking your work. And your robot is URO for... Unidentified rotating object. We are a secret organisation um, devoted to ridding the world of killer robots. How uh, fast is it? We're not quite sure. Uh, we haven't spun it in anger yet, but you'll see it for the first time out there. VWW, very weird and wacky, invertible with an innovative and destructive high mass bidirectional circumferential 2.5 kilogram disc. Now, you know, very inexperienced. From Edinburgh in Scotland, Typhoon 2. The teams fought in previous lightweight and middleweight championships, now they want this heavyweight to be top of the bill. Now, I believe you all, you have a family of robots that you've all built. Yes, this is the heavyweight robot, this is the featherweight robot, and we've got a middleweight. Now, why have you decided to build all these robots when you're, you're supposed to be flying planes, aren't you? We are indeed, but we're trying to interest young people in engineering. Uh, and that's the main theme behind what we're doing in project work. And it certainly works, does it? It certainly does. They're exceedingly keen, and the girls as well. They built the little featherweight on their own. So, what are your tactics when you're driving out there? Well, I'm sorry, but that's a military secret. So those who are defending our airways and skyways are in fact building robots. A rotating cone with a heavy steel outer ring and four rotating claw hammer cutters. It can topple though before the weapon reaches gyroscopic speed. Roboteers, stand by. The teams then, Typhoon on the left hand side, the Edinburgh Air Cadets and URO, captained by Mark Stringer on the right hand side, men in black overalls. Bigger brother of course, Joe, Ian and Ellie Watts on the left and Colossus, captained by Robert Kenyon on the right. In the arena for the house robots, Sir Killalot. Good to see him gleaming, looking mean. Sergeant Bash as dapper as ever. Three, two, one. Activate. Bigger brother, runner-up to Razor in the grand final of the fifth wars. A very capable machine and already flipping URO up onto the ref box. Little black book, it would seem. Colossus under pressure as well has inadvertently pressed the pit release and is in trouble, flipped up and over, 100 kilos, a very low ground clearance, but it didn't matter. Bigger Brother with a reminder on the pit release, but it's already been signalled. Typhoon 2, quick across the arena floor, URO already flapping, one of the side pieces seems to be coming away, does it? It's uh, all this trouble there for URO, we can see the innards exposed, a side panel has been ripped away, URO towards the angle grinder, look at Typhoon 2 and Bigger Brother teaming up here on URO, Mark, Peter and Chris, the URO boys in trouble, little Joe Watts only 10 at the controls of Bigger Brother, good driving as well, he controls the weapons actually Joe, Daddy and drives the ref bot counting Colossus out we saw and I don't think it's going to be long before the newcomers 
Team MIBO Men in Black overalls become a grey and distant memory in Robot Wars history. A tease there for Bigger Brother. Scuttling after Typhoon 2. Tell you what, if you've noticed, but Typhoon 2 is not spinning. I think they've got problems as well in their topples. So, if they can't spin properly, they might not be able to self-right Typhoon 2. Colossus is being counted out by the red bot. Took a long, long look at Colossus before starting the count. They've gone. <laughs> a bigger brother have virtually beaten everyone here. Colossus already battered into submission when it was turned up onto its side. URO turned over. It is invertible, but there's nothing running at all. And what about Typhoon 2? Colossus appears still to be mobile, but it wasn't. It was counted out. And that's what you need to see. Typhoon 2 is still mobile. URO isn't and being counted out. So for me, it will be Colossus and URO who go. The men from Lansing in West Sussex counted out, though. And although Colossus is still moving at the end, it was earlier counted out, I'm sure. Craig may well want to consult with... <laughs> The referee, Sakillot, is getting some revenge here on Bigger Brother. <laughs> A piggyback. Well, that's brotherly love for you. Brothers in arms in the war zone on Robot Wars, the seventh wars. Well, I'm putting him down. Bigger Brother lives to fight another day. Shame about Colossus, really. Could have been a worthy robot had it survived. <laughs> not a little bit longer, but not with driving skills like that. Straight down the pit and URO to follow suit. Yeah, just the sight, <laughs> the sight of Sakilalot had them driving into the pit. All the fight, in all the confusion, Colossus and URO were counted out. That means Bigger Brother and Typhoon, they go marching on!